Absolutely. Good touch. Oh! Oh, goodness me! But no lucky cookie down the line. What a shot from Nishida. And a great illustration of just Japan. Walsh. Into run it goes. Oh, brilliant hustle. Excellent from Curry. And another chance for Japan. Oh, and this time Nishida does pull the trigger. And great delivery of the ball in transition by Yamauchi. His ability to get the ball in play and then run the quick behind and create the smallest thing which Nishida takes advantage of and the substitution we see Miura coming on for Nishida. So Kenta Miura got the start since the timeout. Sakita spits it at the back and Yuji Nishida. Oh. That ball is so fast and Sakita delivers with so much precision that Nishida can launch. There's not a lot you can do about that. He is. Marta serve. Serves that on to Yamamoto. Oh, the hang time on Nishida. And the, the hand moves from Sakita. Everything said this ball is going forward. You'll see on the replay, just a quick flick. He gets that ball out and no chance for Pearson Nishenko to make a read on that play. One-on-one, -on -one, Nishida, you'll take the... Uh, There we go. Took the line away, boss. Yes, but you've limited him the cross court. <laughs> That's just. I mean, how do you how do you solve a problem like Nishida at the moment? You can sing a song about that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but it's always a calculated risk. You have to take away one. Off. It's free ball for Japan. Living quite happy not to use the middle at all, haven't they, right now? But it's great because they're keeping Cuba's middle pinned. That's absolutely right. Just creating that space. The, the read there is very difficult. And about, you allow any room for Nishida for Ishikawa for Here is Yuji Nishida. Good watch by Ma. Not good enough, though. It's an ace service. Nishida pulls the trigger. Ma tried to get one over on him. We can see here using all of the court and the plan. And he's saying, you're going to get blocked sometimes. Nishida's back in the game. And let's look at the difference in his approach here, if we can see on the replay. Yeah, that time he came on the straight line, didn't he? So he could either continue or go cross, whereas before he's been coming out to in a little bit and then trying to go... Good save. Oh! Oh, it's goodness me! So it's not even now the fake set, it's the, it's the fake spike. Serves first in the fourth set. First touch for Sakita and Nishida. And that is how Japan side out. Sakita is not a big guy, but he used every centimeter of his jump and reach and the body control and delivery here. Oh, he's done it again. How many times are Cuba going to allow him to have a free swing to the line? They're going to have to take this ball away from him and force him to hit somewhere else. It's a very calculated risk to take away his cross-court shot, which is still strong. He's got to be able to turn that into an opportunity on the other side. Hogue into Ran Takahashi. Nishida! <laughs> Nearly limbos the net on the way through. Big smiles. There's nothing that boy likes more than bursting volleyballs. And it's great to see from the Japanese team, they look like they really enjoy the way that they're playing in the moment, and we're enjoying watching it too. Yeah, that. And the crowd here chanting his name. And that is why a service Nishida. This boy can play.
Nishida. 14 points for the game. 15 points for the game. And he is giving young Matthias Elsa a hard lesson in international volleyball. Oh, the movement on the ball. Steph block you twice and you think, oh, what can we do next? Well, they've got a chance here with Walsh. Oh, it's been returned off the foot. Maybe that's what they can do. Great angle by Nishida. Canada continuing to hustle, but point lead for Japan. He's ticking along at 56%. And then Hogue. First swing of the game that was for Schwartz. Doesn't find the floor. That's placed by Nishida, who is purring along. The control to put that ball in the space of the court. A big triple block in front of him. Defense is set and just finds the, the small area in the back corner. Wonderful control by Nishida. The, a commit block here by Nishida, blocking cross against Ma. Schwartz. It's a good block connection. Oh, Ishikawa with the set. One, two, three. Carries there. Of course he is, but he can't scramble it over. And that's a frustrating way for the set to end for Canada, a set that largely belonged to Japan. However, here's Yamauchi, 11-11. Great third set, taking shape. A good ball in by Hogue. What a dig. Nishida. High off the hands. And that, the best defender on the court for Japan so far today, yes. Yamauchi. But we could hear that uh, Philip Bland talked about what they want to do defensively against Schwarz. That is not they deep and behind the block. But beautiful control by Nishida. Now Yamauchi will serve down the line, try and jet him. Three for Ishikawa. Another good contact, but Ishikawa equal to it. Yamamoto sets Nishida. I think that might have come off Von Berkel's head, but either way, it's drop wide. And the, the frustration that Steve Maher is feeling right now is, is not one has it's taken uh, his left cheek. <laughs> uh, it's, it's not one that uh, is unique to him. There's players all over the world who haven't found a solution to Nishida's attack with their block. Giant of a man. Two meters ten. Ducks to get through every door. Nishida! Oh, that's just dropped wide, but Hogue and Demyanenko have got themselves in a great position. Nick Hogue. He thought he had this one. He's enjoying the fight here between him and Nishida. Still a smile on his face after that. We're all thinking, everyone's thinking, well, this is going to go in front for a swing through four. But no, that's not to be the case. And we can talk about how well Sakita is setting the ball, but what he does for the whole team, he's, uh, his coordination is all... for Japan could be trouble for Cuba there is trouble for Cuba even with Lopez there it's still block out well, they're trying to challenge mid rally challenge at the end of the point and they can't do it they were thinking that there was an issue actually you know that looked like it went on for uh, Nishida on his, uh, on his shoulder there. flick that wrist around cut the ball back Good up. Oh, what a set. Oh, he's not made it. Didn't catch the block either. So an unforced error from Nishida. But they created the, the chance, didn't they? So they... Because on the, on the first swing from Yant, Takahashi actually pulled hands on... They did well to catch up to that one. Nishida's definitely back in the game now. The smile's back on his face. 
And a very similar ball with, uh, from before. Sakita being pushed towards position four and sending a long ball back, stretching the Cuban block. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and make sure to subscribe to Power Volleyball for more volleyball videos.